You are the man who gave them the power to destroy themselves. And the world is not prepared. Truman needs to know what's next. Two. What's next? One. Hello, everyone. This is your good old neighbor, Nick Hicks, Spider Verse, and Frozen Two fans. That's one here, and to and tonight I am doing a another news video, and I'm very apology. I haven't done a news video of the penalty because in the penalty. I was just busy doing my other video like Smash or Pass or my box of a video about Disney Wish. And I just got done watching two movies, which are nothing Leo, which I was really surprising, and Ladybugs and Cat and in a cat movie. Honestly, didn't like that film and I will do a review on that film. It won't be a rant. But it's going to be a review. It's like a it's like a mediocre film, but I think Leo is is way better than that Ladybugs movie. Which honestly, I like the TV show, but the movie um, but the movie itself, I just didn't care for it. Honestly, guys, so the news we're gonna cover up, which is another than the final season of Stranger Things. Do you remember the Stranger Thing? Because honestly, if you see the last season, you know what I'm talking about. So hey guys, anyway. Tonight, we're going to talk about, for, t for tonight news, we're going to talk about the final season of Stranger Thane has beginning filming. And we're going to do a rant about Gerard Butler is replying his role as Hiccup's father for the live action How to Change the Dragon movie. So what's the point of getting the live action film since you're going to, since you're going to blame back the actor that he was as Hiccup's father in the animation film? Like, come on, you're not Disney Universal, you're not Disney. And we're going to talk about Cruella 2 is in the work. And last not least, we're going to talk about Kung Fu Panda, um, Kung Fu Panda 4. It's going to take, um, it's going to take the element for, um, for the, for the Spider-Verse film. Which, honestly, we're going to get to that last. Honestly, honestly, we're going to start off first, which is now in the final season of Stranger Things has beginning filming. Here we go. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Back to the same. So, hey guys, I'm probably you guys are wondering what is Stranger Things season. Well, they was continually making the uh, making the final season last year, but due to the writer strike and the actor strike going on, so that's why they had to delay the production about this. And now they got the news that the final season of Stranger Things has beginning filming. Yup, all the actor and actress like Max Mayfield and Eleven. On the guy, I just heard that Molly Bobby Brown. I just honestly, honestly, guy, I'm probably honestly, honestly, guy, I'm probably, I'm probably, um, I probably, I got a feeling that she, that honestly, she don't want to be in this show. Which honestly, if she's not in the show, so what will happen to her characters? Well, just as honestly, guy, just wait and see, just wait and see how this season will pull out. Because honestly, guy, I just heard that, uh, honestly, I just heard that the final season of Stranger Things is going to be like the first season, which I will be grateful. And yeah, sure, it won't be as good as the um as the last season we got in twenty twenty two. But overall, I'm still looking forward to it. I'm a huge fan of Stranger Things. But Stranger Things is not my favorite TV show of all time. But I'm part of this show is my number eleven favorite TV show ever. Which honestly, guys. Honestly, guys, I'm still waiting on the news of Cobra Kai new season. Yes, I understand they got celebrity and that show is so busy with the white time and that. Honestly, honestly, I totally understand what Daniel's actor is doing with his Karate Kid movie, which is coming out this year. Which I cannot wait for the new Karate Kid movie. This is the main reason why that Co honestly, honestly, guys, this is the main reason why that Cobra Kai is honestly one of my favorite show I have ever seen in my life since um um since um. Since every show that came out, honestly. Anyway, guys, that was my thought on the final season of Stranger Things has beginning filming. So let's hope this filming um will not get away because I honestly I just honestly I just do not want to hear any of the wider strike nonsense. Honestly, guys, that wider strike and the actor strike go fly out in the freaking window. All I care. So hey guys, so we had to get to the nether news, which is nether than Gerard Butler is we're playing his war as Hiccup's father for the live action How to Train Your Dragon movies. I guess said, 
what the heck? You're gonna make a live action remake of How to Train Your Dragon, correct? So why in the world of Neptune above that you hired Gerard Butler that he was as Hiccup Spotter in the animation? Honestly guys, this is kind of, honestly, you know this remind me? This remind me of back in 2018. When they do a live action of the Lion King, which I was not in for that. I mean, um, on John, on which honestly, I was just, um, I was just not looking forward to that. I meant. So after I heard that the actor of Mufasa is going to reprise his role as Mufasa for the Lion King remake, this is remind me. Honestly, this is exactly what Universal is doing. Universal is just hiring Gerard Butler as Hiccup Spotter. And to be honest, they should hire David Hardboard. And yeah, sure, David Hardboard would not be as good as Gerard Butler. But if you want to do a remake, why not hire David Hardboard? Because David Hardboard have the have the beard and they have the deep voice. Honestly, kind of deep voice, honestly. But anyway, but my casting choice for Hiccup Spotter. Why not hire David Hardboard? David Hardboard as Hiccup Spotter will make. Honestly, will make 100% sense than Joel Butler. And no offense to Joel Butler, but honestly, God, I'm probably Joel Butler don't want, um, honestly, don't want to be as Hiccup's father because his story was, um, was occlusion to his story in How to Train Your Dragon 2. But I, honestly, honestly, God, I got a bad feeling that a live action How to Train Your Dragon movie is going to, is going to, it's going to accepted how good three How to Train Your Dragon movies. And I gotta be honest, that How to Train Your Dragon live action movie, honestly guys, this How to Train Your Dragon live action movie make me hype more, just for, honestly, that, that How to Train Your Dragon live action movie, honestly guys, this movie make me, um, honestly guys, this movie make me hype, uh, hype Despicable Me 4, because honestly guys, I think Despicable Me 4 is what, Honestly, guys, it's going to be a way better. It's going to be a way better universal, a universal movie, than the, than the live action How to Train Your Dragon movies. And honestly, the story is just like the same old story, like the animation. So what's the point of making a live action movie, making the first one? Like, come on, this is not Disney, you know. Honestly, guys, honestly, guys, this is not DreamWorks. This is seriously a Disney thing. Disney thing because Disney is so upsetting to make a live action movies. What next? Um, is Women Asian going to do a live action movie? Is Pixar going to do a live action movie? What's going on? Honestly, guy, if I'm living in a different, honestly, guy, if I honestly am I living in a different dimension? What honestly, honestly, guy, what is going on? What is going on? We need, honestly, we need to stop this news. Anyway, I just, honestly, I just want this, honestly, I just want this movie get canceled. Okay, we don't need a live action How to Train Your Dragon movie. And no offense to John but well, but it didn't make no sense. Honestly, honestly, guy, it didn't make no sense that you hire the same actor as the same character in the same movies. I just didn't make no, honestly no sense. It's kind of my mean that you do the same thing with The Lion King by Disney. So yeah, that was my widow aunt on Joel Butler is replying his role as Hiccup Spotter. I am not happy and I give it to you that Harry Thomas Pictures ain't going to be happy because he's a huge major fan of Harry Jr. Dragon. But you know what Universal did? He took his film and just remake it. Yeah, I got a bad feeling that this remake is going to ruin how good of that three How to Train a Dragon. Honestly guys, honestly guys, stay tuned for my video called Why I'm Not Excited for the Live Action How to Train a Dragon movie because I would give you a full uh honestly I'm honestly I honestly I can be here all day when I'm gonna talk about this film. But the film is not coming out in twenty twenty five and I give it to you that frozen three is going to kick How to Train a Dragon live action movie in a behind because I give it to you right now. Anyway, so let's move on to the nether news. Which is nether and Corrupted 2 is in the work. Honestly guys, to be honest, I just do not want Corrupted 2. And yeah, sure, Corrupted is honestly one of my favorite Disney live action movies I've ever seen uh, since Enchantress. But why do we need a Corrupted 2? So you guys, and now I'm hearing that Emma Stone said that Corrupted 2 is a work in progress. And filming will be beginning hopefully sooner. Rather than later. I love Emma Stone. But I'm very sorry Emma Stone. But. But do we seriously need a Corrupted 2? And don't worry. This is not going to be a bad film. But I was just saying. Why? Just why? Corrupted don't need to be a franchise. 
Honestly, guys, we are living a different timeline. Okay, first we're hearing about Joy Butler is replying to his role as Hiccup's father. And now I'm hearing that my actress named Emma Stone say Corrupted 2 is, um, is going to be on the work. Honestly, Emma Stone, just stick to your original film. Enough making sequel to your film. Enough already. It's annoying. Anyway, there's nothing to say about it. Honestly, guys, why do we need a Corrupted 2? Honestly, guys, it's kind of reminding me. It's kind of reminding me that you're going to agree my Beauty and the Beef 2 with the live action form, which I just do not want that to happen. Or you're going to, um, or you're going to make a Beauty, um, Beauty and the Beef TV show, which is never going to come out anytime soon because that has some gay reference in that. So, yeah. Anyway, so the last news I'm going to talk about, and Ouija Gaming, you're definitely, you're definitely going to be happy about this because I already know that I already know that you are really looking forward to Couple Planet 4, so thank you so much for giving me um for giving me some hype for Couple Planet 4. This is the main reason why I put Couple Planet 2 as the hmm as the four favorite anime movies I ever see in my life. Which another then Couple Planet 4 is taking element to the Spider Verse film. So let me read it all together. It's gonna to be very mouthful, you ask me. Anyway, I'm trying to get my mouth ready. Anyway, Couple Planet 4. Take information, uh, information from the Spider Verse film. Let's read it. When a fat, I mean, when the fight happened, we have a face off moment where we do a sp split, almost like a ember brushing paint in the background, and we really went to town with the Spirit's Remnant. I am so happy that, that the movie is going to be like the Spider-Verse. And who cares about the people said in the comment? On the guys, on the guys, I cannot believe why all people are not really, not really liking this news. People, you like Spider-Verse movie, correct? So why do the Neptune above that you're being, that you're being nitpick after nitpick to stay away from Troll Band Together Fame 2001. Troll Band Together Fame 2001 is hypnotizing you guys. Stop that away, it's annoying. Anyway, to be honest, I am no problem that Kumpa Panda 4 is going to be like a Spider-Verse film. Which, to be honest, I want all the film, I will be, I want all the film to be like Spider-Verse, like Frozen 3. If you, honestly, if you want to do, honestly, if you want to, hey Disney, take note. Hey Disney, if you want to make a fight, honestly, if you want to make a fight scene in Frozen 3, make it as a Spider-Verse film. If you do that, I will be in a theater at the opening night showing. I will beat it right away. Because I love the Frozen movie. Frozen 1 is a masterpiece. Frozen 2. Honestly one of the second best movie I have seen in my life. And my number 4 is Wish. And my number 5 is Oppenheimer. Which yeah. Anyway. I am so happy that Kumpa Panda 4 is going to take Element to a Spider-Verse film. Like the fight scene with Poe. Honestly I cannot wait for the fight scene. And to be honest. This fight scene is, I hate to say it, it's going to be a lot better than the fight scene in Comfort Fender 2. Oh, God, okay, guys. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm, don't, don't hurt me, people. Don't hurt me. Anyway, on the guy. No, on the guy. I'm honest, guys. Uh, don't get me wrong. I love the fight in Comfort Fender 2. But I think the fight scene is going to be a much better fight scene in a Comfort Fender movie than the first film, the second film, and even the third film. Because I'm probably the third film was based on comedy than action, honestly. Which that's the only problem I have for Kung Fu Panda 3 because it, um because honestly 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 guys and honestly um that film was not um was not focused on the, the story. Honestly guys on honestly guys they keep focused on the comedy which I do like a comedy but on the guy on the guy stay tuned for my review all the Kumpa Panda 4 I mean Kumpa Panda movies with enough the Kumpa Panda 4 and Kumpa Panda holiday special will be included and I do not care uh this is not Christmas the bottom line is I just need to review that because I did watch it and it was really heartwarming and very emotional. Anyway guys that was my thought on Kumpa Panda 4 is taking information about the um from the Spider-Verse film, and I really hope Sony and I really hope Phil Moore and Chris Miller will not sue DreamWorks because on the guy, if they honestly, if they sue DreamWorks because of this, I am going to be very disappointed because I, on the guy, no offense, I like on the guy, no offense to Phil Lord the Chris Miller, but on the guy, their attitude is just getting even worse. On the guys like um like rushing the animator and and forced the animator to make our animation of the Spider-Verse film for eleven hours. Even I love the Spider-Verse film and the huge part of my heart. But that story, it was completely horrifying. And I feel so bad that animators 
had to took eleven hours, and I'm not gonna be happy. I'm happy that that the animator was took eleven hours to do it. So I just feel bad. Honestly, guys, no fans. Honestly, guys, no fans to my favorite movie of all time. But honestly, guys, I'm. On the guys, you gotta you gotta take off your hat and you gotta be feeling bad, um, that the animator is being too being too hard. By for Lord and Chris Miller, I mean for Lord and Chris Miller is being hard with the animator because the animator deserve more enjoyment than being workaholic. Anyway, that was my thought on Cover Pen. Of, on the on the guy and on the guy, that was my thought. On Kung Fu Panda 4 is taking information about the Spider-Verse film about the fight scene. Cannot wait. And that was my thought on the Cabrera 2 is going to be on the work. Like, why? And that was my little rant about Joel Butler is replying his role as Heck of Sparta. Which, which, honestly, at the same time, why do we need this film? On the guy, why do we need this film? What next? Um, you're going to make a live action remake of Rise of the Guardians, Madagascar? Honestly. You better not touch Copa Panda. Honestly, I swear to God. If I, honestly, if I see Yonaboto touching Copa Panda and make a live action form, it will be even worse than Poe from the Disaster Movie. Do you remember the Poe from the Disaster Movie? Yes, what I thought. So, so yeah, guys, please do not make a live action remake to Copa Panda 4. Honestly, guys, have you never seen a movie called Disaster Movie? They did a live action Poe. It was really creepy. And Jack Black Poe is 100 times better than a Disaster Movie Poe. Which, Disaster Movie Poe, it was creepy as heck. And that was my thought on the final season of Stranger Things has beginning filming. Which, I cannot wait to see it. And I, and I really hope this is not going to be another delay. Let's hope not. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, if you want to see more of this, please... Hi, how you really like main menu? You hit the subscribe button, turn the notification, and share the video with your whole family. And I'm very sorry I said you in my video, but I said you in my video. It's nothing new. Anyway, stay tuned for my movie review on Leo, and stay tuned for my movie movie review on, Le on, on Ladybug and Cat Noah. Honestly, I just didn't care about the film, and I just prefer the TV show better than the movies. And yeah, sure, the animation looks really beautiful, and even the one girl, the one main, um... Only guy, the one main girl character was was absolutely my crush, and I absolutely love her. her honestly, her, honestly, her outfit, her eyes, it looks so beautiful, and her voice, man, she kind of. Uh, um, honestly, guys, honestly, guys, I know she don't. Honestly, she, honestly, I know she don't voice by the same actress of Anna, but she kind of sound like Anna and Rapunzel at the same time. Anyway, have a great night, everyone, and I see you guys next time. And once again, yadios and good night.